There we go. Just warming up here, get nice and low. Curtsy lunges, stretch out that hip. This time, when you stand up, let's stay on the same side and you're gonna alternate. So right kick, left curtsy. So you're just gonna kind of open up this hip. Nice and low, open up. Let's get two more. There's one. Two, let's switch to that other side. So right curtsy, left kick. Chest nice and tall, singing forward here. Looks so nice doing hit from home in this studio instead of my apartment. <laughs> two more. One, two, let's go ahead, bring that knee front, open up wide, keeping it elevated the whole time. I know a couple of you, I see your names are used to this background. Um, in our in-person classes, so it might be some nostalgia. Switch. You need about three more here. One, two, three. Last thing, we're just going to do some jumping jacks because today we got lots of things to do. Five. Four, three, two, one. Good. All right. Um, so we're gonna get started. So three moves, 30 seconds for each. I'm gonna demo them very quickly here. Um, first one, you're gonna use a dumbbell if you have it. If you don't have dumbbells, you can do it body weight. Um, but what we're gonna do, I'm gonna stand up nice and tall, roll those shoulders back, open up that ice proud chest. We're gonna sink into a low squat as low as you can go, and then you're gonna dig those heels in the ground, get those dumbbells up. So you really want to use your legs and the power from that jolt to get those dumbbells up. If you don't have those, again, just fast paced squats using those arms up and down. So that's our first move. Our second move, walking lunges. So you're going to walk far away from that uh, computer. We're just going to go lunge, alternate going forward. Once you get all the way one way, just turn around and go the other way. You can always add weights to that if you want. And then Lastly, we're going to do inchworms. So same thing. We're going to walk as far back as we can. Um, I'm going to show you from the side. We're going to walk our hands out into a plank, and then you're going to walk your feet back in. So I'm going to, let me put this down a little bit so you can see. So walking my hands all the way out till I hit that plank. Once I hit that nice plank, I'm going to walk my feet just itty bitty baby steps and as far as I can go. And then I'm just going to go back with my hands. So you never fully stand up. All right, so let's go ahead, grab some dumbbells if you have them. 30 seconds for all these moves. We're gonna do three rounds of it. Um, so let's go ahead, grabbing those weights. Got 30 seconds on my timer. We're getting started in three, two, and one. Let's go. Nice deep squat, Try those dumbbells up. Inhale, exhale up. Already at that halfway point. Two more. One, two. Good, breathe. Go ahead, drop those weights. We're gonna go ahead, walk as far away as you can. Walking lunges, you can use a dumbbell if you want. All right, here we go. Get set in three, Two and one, let's go. Nice and low. Back and forth, keeping that chest up. Good, switch. Good, 10 seconds. Three, two, one, good. Inchworms, so we're gonna walk those hands out, walk those feet back in. So get some space. Here we go, three, two, one, walk those hands. Hit that plank, walk those feet.
Got about 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Good. Back to those dumbbells. Ground to press. We got 30 seconds. For the next round, if you felt like those interns were too easy, hit a push up at the bottom. All right, so here we go. Three, two, one. Ground to press. Let's go. All the momentum from those legs. Big, big drive up. Inhale, exhale. Checking my time. We got 10 seconds. Let's get three more. Three, two, and one. Good. Either hold on to those weights for those lunges, or we can go body weight here. You got five seconds. And three, two, one. Let's go. Lunges. Big, big drive. Try to keep a pretty aggressive tempo with it. Getting that heart rate up. Halfway. Get really close. <laughs> Three, two, one, inch worms. Let's go ahead, find some space around you. Here we go. This time I'm gonna add that push up. Let's try to challenge yourself if you can do it too. Three, two, one. Let's go lock those hands. Drop it for that push up. Walk those feet. And hands. Push up. Feet. Let's get one more. Walk it out. Get that push up. Walk those feet back in. Stand up nice and tall and breathe. One more round here. Getting those dumbbells up. 10 seconds. All right, shake out those arms. Here we go. Three, two, one. Ground and press. Let's go. Go oh, about the halfway point. Three more. One, two, three, drop. Grab, uh, either hold on to those dumbbells or get ready for those lunges. Big deep breath in, deep exhale. Here we go. Three, two, one, lunges. Nice, proud chest, keep it tall. Halfway. Good, let's get three more lunges. Here's one, here's two, here's three. Relax, inchworms, and then we get a quick water break. All right, here we go. Get set. Try to drop it for that push up here. Three, two, one. Let's go. Inchworms. Walk those hands. Hit that push up. Walk those feet. Ten seconds. Good. Let's get one more. Finish up one more. Walk it out. Push up. Walk it back in. And stand up. All right. One circuit down. Quick water break. You got about a minute. Starting my timer now. 
Then we're gonna go on to round two. It's gonna get a little bit more aggressive with those um, kind of cardio moves. And that one was more sneaky cardio, lots of just up and down movement. So it's gonna keep the heart rate up without actually having to jump a lot. So, um, two words you probably don't like, sneaky and cardio. Um, so three different moves this time. First one, crisscross dumbbell squat jack. So if you don't have dumbbells, you're gonna do the same exact thing without them. If you do have dumbbells, you're gonna hold them by your side. Um, you're gonna cross your feet at the top. So like this, little cross. They don't have to be all the way over like this. So don't really like try too, too hard for that. It can just be like kind of like one foot in front of the other. So I'm gonna um, drop my camera a little bit so you can see that a little bit better. All right, so you don't have to think all the way here. You just have to think kind of like this. Um, and then when you come down, you're gonna hit that squat. Cross, squat, cross, squat. Keeping those dumbbells. Again, you can do those without the dumbbells as well. So that's your first move. Your second one, we're gonna be on the ground. We're gonna do plank tap mountain climbers. So you're gonna count right here, 30 seconds. We're gonna do one shoulder tap, other shoulder tap, one, two, three, four mountain climbers. And we're just gonna keep repeating. Option, you could drop up for your knees for these and then come back up on your toes for four counts. Um, and then the last move we're gonna do is gonna be bicycles. So you're gonna flip on over, feet up, going back and forth, opposite um, uh, elbow to knee. Okay, so I'm gonna leave the camera down for those crisscross jacks so that way you can really see my feet. But we're gonna get set here. Grab those dumbbells if you have them. We're gonna get started here in three, two, one, let's go. So deep squat, cross the feet, squat, feet. Halfway. You feel it in those inner thighs a little bit. One more, three, two, one, good. Drop to the ground, plank, tap, tap, four mountain climbers. At 10 seconds, take your time. Try to stay up the whole time for these. Here we go. Three, two, one. So tap, tap, one, two, three, four. Halfway. Ten. Last round. Tap. Tap. Four, three, two, one. Good. On your back. Bicycles. This is that kind of active recovery move. Breathe through it. Try to get the hurry down because you got that aggressive uh, squat jacks coming up. All right. Here we go. Three, two, one. Timer's on. Breathe. Exhale. Halfway, 15. Keep those shoulders up, keep going. Five seconds. Three, two, one, relax. All right, so that's round one. Two more, let's get up on your feet. Dumbbells in hand, crisscross squat jacks. All right, here we go. Timer's on in three, two, one. Let's go. So start with that cross and squat. Take your time. Even if you have to slow down a little bit, don't stop moving. You only got 10 seconds, probably about three more. Three, two, and one. Drop those weights. Hit that plank. Plank top, mountain climbers coming up. You have 10 seconds to get your heart rate down. Breathe, inhale. 
Deep exhale. All right, here we go. Starting up in three, two, one, go. Tap, tap, one, two, three, four, again. Butt down, let's go. Ten. One more. Tap, tap, three, and relax. All right, flip on that back, bicycles. All right, so this is that active recovery move. Try to get that heart rate down a little bit. Here we go. Get started in three, two, one. Let's go, bicycles. Inhale, exhale. Neutral spine, neutral neck, looking straight. 10. Three, two, one, relax. All right, one more round on your feet. Crisscross jacks, crisscross applesauce. Grab those weights. All right, here we go. Starting up in three, two, one, crisscross. Last one of these. Ten seconds. Stick with it. Three more. Three, two, and one. Drop those weights. Hit the ground. Planks. All right. Here we go. Tap, tap. One, two, three, four. Mountain climbers. Three, two. Go, 30 seconds, tap, tap, four, three, two, one, tap, tap, four, three, two, one, tap, tap. Keep going, halfway. Eight seconds, one more. Tap, tap. Four, three, two, one. Drop it on your backs. So last time for these mountain or not mountain climbers, these bicycles. And then we'll get another quick little water break. So here we go. Three, two, one. Bicycles go. Ten. Three, two, one, relax. All right, take a breather. We're at the half point of class. So about two more circuits left. Grab a quick, quick water break. I will start explaining the next one in about 10-ish seconds. Okay, so while you're recovering, um, next one, we're gonna start with a little more upper body um, cardio. So there's not a whole lot of moves that are upper body cardio. So if you have multiple sets of dumbbells, I would go heavier for this one. So um, this one, you can really usually get a lot of weight with it. If you don't have a heavier one, that's fine. But we're gonna go about hip width apart with the feet. You're gonna sink into kind of like a half squat. So just about here, it's not a full bend. If you can see from the side, I'm just kind of going right about there. Once I hit that, I'm gonna zip up my coat. So what that means, I'm keeping that dumbbell straight as if I'm about to zip my coat up. And then I'm gonna flick my wrist to the top. So zip that coat, flick all the way up to stop, keeping that dumbbell straight to my ear. 
So all the way up, flick. I'm doing a little hop with my feet too. This is gonna get the heart rate up a lot because you're jumping, you're kind of flinging that dumbbell. Um, it's a little bit of everything. So we're gonna do 30 seconds on each arm. Again, if you don't have that dumbbell, that's fine right here or grab something like a water bottle or anything like that. Um, and then we're gonna do lunge jacks. So lunge jacks is basically a lunge jump except for one leg. So we're gonna do 30 seconds each side again for these. So you're starting that split stance, arms behind you. All I'm gonna do is bring it back to center and stick with that same leg. Lunge, lunge, just like that. If you can't do those lunge jacks, let's do drive, drive. So hitting that lunge, lifting that one leg up. All right, so this one is definitely probably your toughest one so far. So let's get in that mindset, get ready. Grab that dumbbell. Four technically moves, but really only two because we're just doing it each side. All right, so here we go. Starting with those snatches, grab that dumbbell. Get started, three, two, one. So little half squat, zip up that coat, flick the wrist at the top, bring it back down. Use those legs, a little hop with the feet. Exhale up. This is like a crossfitting type move, but modified for general population. One more, flick, relax. Go ahead, switch those dumbbells, 10 second breather. All right, get set, three, two, and go. Here we go, snatches, flick. Exhale up, inhale down. 15, halfway. If your dumbbell is not heavy, you might be able to get more reps than me. One more. Good, relax. Good, drop that weight. Lunge jacks now, so pick a side. I'm gonna start with my right leg first. Here we go, get ready. 30 seconds in three, two, one, let's go. Keep going, I'm just switching so I can see my uh, timer a little bit. Three, two, one. 10 second breather, other side. Again, that option, knee drive, right here. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Halfway. Three, two, one, relax. All right, little extended breather here. This is a tough round. 20 seconds. When you're ready, grab that dumbbell. We're gonna do those snatches. We'll do that right side first. All right, deep breath in, deep exhale. Here we go. Starting up in three, two, one, snatches, go. Zip up that coat, flick the wrist. Halfway. Good, one more. Good, relax, drop that weight. Shake it out, 15 second breather. And we're switching that opposite side. So we'll do this one. This one's a rough one. All right, 
Here we go, deep breath in, deep exhale. Grab that dumbbell, three, two, one. Let's go. Fifteen, halfway. One more. And relax. All right, squat jacks next. Or um, lunge jacks, not squat jacks. All right, so get that right foot forward, left foot back. Get set. We're starting in three, two, one. Let's go. Nice and low, feet together. Halfway. Three, two, one, relax. 15 second breather, we're switching to the opposite side. All right, here we go, left side. Three, two, one, let's go. Ten seconds, keep with it. Two more. One, two, relax. Thirty second breather, longest break here. One more round of this. All right, so we'll start with that snatch on that right side. Heart rate's climbing. Getting uncomfortable in a good way. Let's grab that dumbbell. Got 10 seconds left. So we had the longest recovery this round. So let's really try to be aggressive with our tempo or our weights. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Right side, last time. Snatch. Ten seconds. Three more. One, two, three. Drop that weight. Fifteen second recovery. Switching that opposite side. All right. Grab that dumbbell. Here we go. Three, two, one. 30 seconds. Good, big leg drive here. Push through those legs. Halfway, 15. Can you crank it up a little bit more? Two more, one. Maybe jump, two. Drop that dumbbell. Recovery. Last one of these spot jacks. And then we get that water break and we finish with our final mini circuit. Only two moves. Um, so we're gonna get it moving. So here we go. Right side, lunge jacks. Three, two, one. Let's go. Keep with that tempo. You can do anything for 30 seconds. You just gotta put your mind into it. Keep hustling. You got about 10. Crank up that tempo. Let's go. Got three more in ya. Three, two, one. Relax. 
20 second breather, final, final leg. Shake out those legs. 10 seconds. All right, here we go. Last one of these. Three, two, one, let's go. Get some height with this pop. It's gonna help you a little bit. So pop, pop, up, halfway. The slower you are, the more you're gonna feel it in your muscles, get fatigued. So keep that tempo. Five, four, three, two, last one, and relax. Woo! All right, take your breather. One minute of recovery time, little baby sips, because we got more jumping to do, so you don't want that water sloshing around too much. Never a good thing. All right. So, last circuit, and then we're done for the day. So, um, I'm gonna demo those moves while you're taking our recovery. So, two options for this first move. Your first one, you can have, if you have dumbbells, what you're gonna do, we're gonna go into that plank position. You're not gonna do anything with the dumbbells really. You're just gonna jump up, stand with them, press up up top. We've been doing these a lot lately. They're really good for that burnout, for that cardio and for um, your muscles. All right, so all it is, jump out, jump in, take those dumbbells to the top. If you don't have dumbbells, you're just gonna do regular burpees with a jump at the top. You can always walk your feet in and out instead of that hop. So that's our first move. And then our second move, we're gonna finish with skier swings. So if you have dumbbells, you're gonna go dumbbells behind you, swinging forward, just like this. Uh, if your weights are too heavy, one dumbbell in the middle, you can do a dumbbell swing that way. And then if you don't have any dumbbells at all, then what you're gonna do instead, you're gonna do the little kind of like, squat jumps. So either right here, well squat jumps, if that's too aggressive for you, let's just go kind of like a jogging in place, back, forward, back, forward, okay? So let's get started. Last little bird down here, two times, only two rounds, 30 seconds for both of them, all right? So get on the floor, either 30 seconds of burpees without dumbbells, or you're gonna grab those dumbbells. All right. Here we go. Big deep breath in, deep exhale. 30 seconds in three, two, one. Let's go. So jump in, dumbbells all the way up, press back down, jump in, jump out, arms up and down. 15, as aggressive as you can. This is that final burnout. 10. One more. And relax. Breathe, 20 seconds. Next one, dumbbell skier swings, or you can do those kind of hops or that jump. Whatever you got. All right, picking up those weights. Skier swings in three, two, one. Let's go. Same thing here, aggressive with the speed. You only have 90 seconds of work left. Use those hips. You can see me, I'm going back, hips forward. Three, two, one, relax. All right. Last two things here. Back on the ground with those dumbbells. Burpees next. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. In, out, up, down. Two, 
15. One more. And relax. Drop those weights. Final thing here, ski your swings. Shake out those arms. 30 seconds and you are done. All right, grabbing those dumbbells. Big deep breath, deep exhale. Here we go, three, two, one. Timer's on, ski your swings. Aggressive tempo, down, up, down, up. Halfway. Let's get four more. One, two, three, and four. Drop it, shake it out. That is it, that is a wrap. We will see you next week. Um, have a wonderful week. We did not miss a Monday.